Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your general reading for the month of April. It's going to be spirit messages that come for, come through for you guys. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. For all of you that are new to my channel, please subscribe, like, and share. That way you'll continue to get notifications of all the readings that I post. But also I can pick up on your energy and make it more personal for you. Um, spirit will send me messages that will only resonate for you and you'll feel that. Okay? This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Spirit. Thank you. I did just open up my Etsy shop. For those of you that inquired about a personal reading, you can head over and visit that shop if you want. It is just beginning. So I have like um, three or four readings that I'm offering on there now. A very, a, they're very inexpensive. I don't feel like I should offer much for guidance for people. <clears throat> so head over there if you're interested. Feeling the world, card of 13. So you're definitely feeling grounded this month's, month. The royal you. <clears throat> it's like you're in all your feels this month, guys. <clears throat> and of course, my voice is starting because I've been trying to do readings all day on my day off. You will be the last one because not only am I getting hoarse, but my stomach is growling. Okay. For Sagittarius spirit, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Thank you. Beginning a new cycle. <clears throat> it didn't flip over. But there's something you might be, get, be beginning this month. Pay attention to feathers. Because there's a bird right there. Discovering truth. You stand in the light of truth. Um, and this one. I did put up um, a love reading a couple days ago. I will leave the link below if you haven't seen that. And I've also did an April, May, and June spring reading for career finances and love that might bring additional messages to this reading. So if you want to check that out, I'll also leave that link below. Door to value. Some kind of abundance is coming towards you this month. 13, 31, this didn't flip over, but look at all that glowing light beyond the doors, beyond the, it's like a vault, money, happiness, it's like breathtaking, all right, message for Sagittarius, sun, moon, rising, thank you, spirit, all tied up. Maybe finding out this truth will release you from something. You're definitely having a victory in something. And with the glowing light, I feel like you're in all your feels this month. With feeling the world. feeling restricted though it's like the eight of swords energy spirit what messages do you have for Sagittarius for the month of April the path something that's part of your journey part of your you know your destination with the wheel of fortune here something is going to feel like a breakthrough it's going to keep you going and not give up with the wounded warrior you're going to make a decision on something. All right, Spirit, what messages do you have for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Thank you. Eight of Angels, see? Something has you feeling restricted, but, I mean, Spirit is with you this month. Divine Order. 
there's going to be balance to your balance to this this month something that you're feeling stressed about you have an illusion of feeling trapped and some kind of hurt five of swords some kind of loss some kind of hurt but you are moving out of that energy with the six of stars all right spirit thank you what kind of message what messages do you have for sagittarius Six of Hearts. Oh, dare I say, did somebody from the past hurt you? I know there's so many people that say, I don't want the past. All right, let's see. Yeah, somebody from the past definitely hurt you. It could have been a fire sign. But through this hurt, that was, which is part of your path, you gained strength. You gained the strength to move on. You've gained the strength to overcome it. You might, you probably were discovering truth about this situation. Like I said, and it broke, it made you break free. And now you are shining like the Empress. More butterflies, guys. Pay attention to butterflies this, this month. But you're shining like the Empress. You're glowing and people are noticing it. Spirit, what is your advice for Sagittarius this month? Your advice for Sagittarius this month. Anything else? All right. Oh, four came out. I'm taking it. Because magician was at the bottom of the deck the last time. You're manifesting. It's like you're manifesting something. You, There is something you have in your heart and in your soul that you want to bring to fruition. And look at this. You've gone within. You've healed. You might even be in the process of healing and just taking a break. But you're in that break, you're getting all this clarity of how you want to pr proceed what you want to do for yourself that's going to bring you happiness. The four of trees is here. I feel like you're coming out of that state in which you're holding stuff to yourself. You're growing beyond that. You're taking that leap to something. Yeah, look at this. You're taking that leap to more... Um, like a, a more peaceful life for yourself. Somewhere in the near past, you were hurt by someone from your past. It, it had you feeling restricted. It had you feeling like all tied up, like you just didn't know what to do with these emotions. But knowing that it's part of your discovery and that you are being divinely guided, you, you grounded yourself. You started being grateful for every day. You started feeling, seeing the beauty in every day, the feeling in the world. You started seeing everything in a different perspective. You took time to heal and rest. And now you are going to move on and it's gonna lead you to a more peaceful life. You're manifesting, let's see what's behind this. Yeah, you started manifesting after somebody broke your heart. Maybe it's just that mental clarity. Maybe it's just being, a, being that mentally strong that it's like mind over matter, you know? It's like, yeah, you know, if anybody wants to come towards you, it's like, you know, you better be coming right because, you know, I'm, it's that leveling up. You're not dealing with bullshit. Can you please clarify the path? Yeah, you're getting passion back into your life. You're starting to be, you know, people are starting to realize how beautiful you are, how you're glowing, how you're ready to like take on the world. You're sexy to a lot of people. Why is the eight of angels here? The 
Thank you. Yeah. Somebody that you had a connection with hurt you. Why is the Eight of Angels here with the Lover of Spirit? Guys, this past person might try to come back around. The Lovers, the Knight of Cups, there is some kind of communication coming in in April. Oh, I wish I would have already done your love reading for... Yeah, you're going to have a brand new beginning with someone. Please clarify the Six of Hearts. Please clarify the Six of Hearts. You're going to have a victory with this person. They see you glowing. They could want to come. They want to move towards you. They might have hurt you in the past. Why is yeah, it could be a fire sign that hurt you. Look what popped out. And healing, temperance. Somebody hurt you. It definitely could be a fire sign or they have fire in their chart. And look, king and queen of wands, it's like that bond. That unbreakable bond between you and someone from the past. Two cards of Leo. Or fire sign. Why is the strength card here? Because you're having the strength to move on, to come out of like holding back, holding everything to yourself, and you're going to move on and make things happen for you. You might have been holding back because they hurt you. And here again is the Two of Cups. It might be when they come in. I don't know. Let me just... Can you, Spirit, what is going to be? Look at this. Eight of Swords again. There's something that's got you feeling constricted. Three times it showed up. What is the overall outcome for Sagittarius? Yeah, there's somebody traveling to you. Look at this. This came out. This came out just like this. There's somebody traveling to you. Somebody that loves you. But this is... There was an ending here. Something that had you feeling so hurt. But there's hope here. There's wish fulfillment here. And you're taking that leap of faith towards them. Oh, guys, you've got to tell me how this goes for you. I'm going to pull tea leaf cards. For Sagittarius and their person. Sagittarius no, not, and their person. General for, messages for Sagittarius for the month of April. I'm saying other person because somebody's coming back around. All right. Bull, do not back down from opposition. Show strength and fortitude. Guys, you know what I feel like this is when this person comes in with this offer? They're going to come in and sweep you off your feet with this Knight of... With this Knight of Cups. Sometimes you have the illusion of what they were like. Like sometimes your heart wants to remember only the good. So if this person did do something to hurt you, make sure when they come towards you, their energy is completely different from when you ended. Take care. Enemies are working against you. Bad. I don't like that for you. Feather. Someone you know is undependable. And insincere. Perfect. It only keeps getting better. Basket. Recognition. Reward for merit. I feel like that's them seeing you glow and wanting to move strong emotion and passionate love or hate.
guys there might be somebody in your um in your energy that's not for your for your good this month i don't think it's this person making their way back to you i feel like there's another energy maybe somebody's jealous of you envious of you because you're shining Now, good advice from a wise person. Could be your friends, your family, kite, vacation. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. That is what I'm getting with this feather and bat. Someone you know is undependable and insincere. Take care. Enemies are working against you and somebody is trying to come between you and this person. Maybe that's where this pain is coming from. Might be a, maybe a family member of theirs or a family member of yours, a friend with negative energy. All right. Let me get a few more cards. Oh, man. For Sagittarius Spirit, please give me additional clarity. Happy, happy. I, th I think Spirit heard my like pleas for something positive. I believe the two of you might have separated because somebody in your energy was being negative. It was causing a drift between you and your person. It probably wasn't until the pain already happened and the separation happened that this person realized how much they wanted to be with you, realized this lover's energy. And that, that's when they, you know, they come back to you. That's when it's wish fulfillment for both of you. That's when the star card happens. That's when there's hope. You are going to take a leap of faith towards them. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Chameleon Spirit, act as if. So what this is, is um, it's like Law of Attraction. Act like you already have it. Act like this person is already yours. Act as if this person has already reconciled with you. There's a lot of healing energy with here with the purple. And even though she's all tied up, there is healing that's going on. And dolphin spirit, this and that are true. Do a cleansing of your energy, guys. If there is was somebody negative that took you away from someone, caused that wedge between you and this per and the person that you love, clear out that your energy Sage you, sage where you live, the people in your home. When they come back to you, sage them too. Sage that energy out. Cleanse that energy out. This is the one that popped out. Star. Second time for the star. Believe in yourself. You are a wonder, you are a wonder of creation. Wash away all fear and discover you are a shining star. Allow all around you to just be. Let go of trying to control life for the light of your soul will guide you always toward love. Remember, stars are born through explosions of I never remember stars are born through explosions of love. That's such an amazing thing to think of. Love illuminates all things. Never forget you are truly a shining star. This person loves you, Sagittarius. Even though there's somebody negative in your energy that you guys need to overcome and cleanse out, you're still moving forward to this person. This reconciliation is still happening. All right, guys. This was a general reading, I swear. Um, and I will be back for many more readings. I'm going to do a spring love reading. Um, and it's going to go for like one to four months four to eight months and eight to 12 months. It's going to be the general reading and then how it's going to pro, pro, um, proceed. The, those 
throughout the year? What actions, if you're moving, you know, straight forward with this person, okay? So this is your general reading from Spirit, and Spirit really wanted you to know, for those of you that are in separation from a person, and there was negative energy, somebody trying to come between the two of you, don't worry, this is coming back around, all right? And you both will be happy. All right, love and light, stay safe.